We have a lot of multimedia devices nowadays ranging from smartphones, tablets, computers, TVs, audio video receivers, etc. And most of the time we'd like to interconnect them. In this video, I will show you how to connect different devices together to stream music, videos, and pictures through the LNA. So, the LNA is a standard to facilitate access to multimedia content between devices connected within the same network. The primary requirement to interconnect different devices is you must connect your devices to one uh, network connection. So in my case, I have uh, different uh, devices from uh, TV, audio video, receiver, uh, two computers, uh, smartphone, and a tablet. So all of these devices are interconnected into one router and it belongs to one network. So one, one way of uh, streaming videos, uh, videos, music, and pictures is using uh, Bubble UPnP. So for example, in my tablet, so this is a Nexus 7, I downloaded uh, Bubble UPnP. So this is the Bubble UPnP icon. Through uh, Bubble UPnP, you have this uh, menu at the, at the left side and uh, it's divided into two parts. Uh, the first part is local renderer, I mean uh, renderer. Renderer basically is where you would like to uh, play your multimedia, maybe a picture, video, or music. And here, the library. So as you can see, there are different uh, possible sources of the library. Um, it can be the local media server, which is uh, basically where, uh, the device. Uh, in, my, in my case, uh, it's, it's the tablet. Um, you can choose um, a media folder if you're like uh, here um, my tablet has different folders from uh, music video images file system and uh, another important uh, thing here is um, you can choose your library uh, by a cloud it can be your Google Music Google Drive or OneDrive uh, Dropbox uh, etc okay so so let's say for example um, here I'd like to choose uh, my my TV as my render. Uh, so my TV is uh, network capable. It's connected uh, via uh, wired connection uh, through my router. And if I choose I, if I choose uh, music as a library, all tracks, boom, it will play into my into my uh, TV. Okay, so it would take. Um, about uh, three seconds to play depending on the network connection so there it's already playing now if I stop it and then uh, choose the vendor and uh, as you can see um, this is uh, the uh, TXNR709 this is the Onkyo Onkyo um, audio video receiver it's connected to my home theater speakers and uh, if I play it there you go it would play I just have to set my receiver to network and then um, set it uh, to uh, the DLNA Okay, I'm setting it uh, through uh, DLNA and there you go it would uh, play um, my multimedia file so there you go it's already playing now um, I have a computer if I pause it um, and then uh, I choose um, the computer. Um, now you can, I can also choose the uh, my PC. Um, it's uh, the Windows Media Player is uh, DLNA capable. I just have you just have to to enable in Control Panel the, um, the media sharing, 
and um, uh, there are some uh, options in in the Windows Media Player you just have to enable the stream options there's an option there for a stream tab and select allow remote control for, of my player and automatically allow devices to play my media the, those are options in in a Windows Media Player and so let me go back to the Bubble UPnP and uh, if I choose uh, Windows Media Player as the render and I choose um, multimedia there you go it's already playing in my computer so there Okay, so there are a lot of um, opportunities for using uh, DLNA. The primary requirement is uh, again, um, it must your devices uh, must be connected in one network, and you can use a uh, DLNA uh, software like uh, Bubble UPnP, the one that I'm using, and uh, again. Um, from here using a bubble UPnP the render again is uh, where you would play your your um, uh, multimedia um, there's no other settings the primary requirement is uh, as long as uh, it's connected into one network it will be automatically detected here and um, so let's say for example if I choose um, this one my computer and uh, choose images and uh, there you go it will um, display the the um, image in my computer right so so this is very useful um, as I've said you can play videos music and pictures and um, um, all you, this is uh, very simple you just have to uh, to try it from your end so basically that's it uh, it's me again Matt or Tech on Site see you again on my next video hey what's up YouTube it's me again Matt or Tech on Site I'm an online seller of computer parts and accessories at www.tpbc.com you can look for my items by searching my username Tech on Site and this is my YouTube channel. I do unboxing videos and tech reviews. So don't forget to subscribe on my YouTube channel so you can get updates on videos I'm regularly uploading every week. See ya!